All right, here we are back in Newport News, in our uh, the uh, Denby area of Newport News. Ladies Rehab we just purchased. Posted a video yesterday of the house as we bought it. Wanted to show what it looked like after the demo. As you can see, they cleaned up all the trash that was over here. Uh, taking out that rear fence. There'll be a new privacy fence going across there. Have somebody coming to take some of the uh, trees out back here. Clean up all the, you know, grass, mow, all that stuff. Uh, but that's all done and then they did the demo on the inside it really changed the way things look so you can get a real sense for how it's going to go now so if you watched the initial video you'll remember the kitchen was right over there it's going to go back there i think we made the decision that we're going to go ahead and build a wall off of where these switches are we'll move those into the wall bring a wall straight out here over to right about where the end of that door stops and so essentially what we'll have then is a u-shaped kitchen so we don't really have room to put the refrigerator where it was because we have to move it to the left to make room for a dishwasher beside the sink there on the left and that's going to put the refrigerator in front of our switches now you could pull it out three or four inches and reach behind but that's kind of jank so what we've decided to do is bring a wall out from right there where those switches are straight this way and create a u-shaped kitchen so the refrigerator will go first and then counter lazy susan wrapping around to the sink dishwasher will be on the left and then we'll wrap around to the stove right there and then come over and stop right there at the edge of the window so it'll be a nice u-shaped kitchen that'll create kind of a hallway from the door past the utility rooms into this room which will kind of separate that doorway as well so it should look really nice so that's the plan there and then that'll leave room right here directly underneath that light for if you wanted to to put a table in here for a dining area and then we'll put a light right there for that and of course this light up here will be replaced with something nicer that will be the main light for the kitchen then as you recall there was a wall across there that we removed the wall started right there where the paint changes color and then across to right there where there's a hole in the ceiling so that wall was all removed so this now becomes the living room space um, to the left of the door when you come in so it really opens all of this up and we did it without doing much work because that wall was only temporary anyway there was also a closet in this corner because this at one time was a bedroom that's why they built that wall to add a fourth bedroom so we took that out as well so that brought the house back to its original floor plan, which is a much better layout. Uh, removed all the flooring and the subflooring down, or the, the, uh, uh, the it was a quarter inch like Luan, to get everything down to the original subfloor. So we'll have one continuous luxury vinyl floor throughout the entire house. Those of you who have watched our other rehabs know, I always try to do that, where we have one continuous floor all the way through the house with no transition strips. It'll go into the laundry room, it'll go into all the closets, one continuous floor, no transition strips. So it looks really, really nice that way. Then you'll recall we were going to make some changes here. There was a door right here and this closet behind here. There was a wall back there and this was a closet from the hallway. We took that door out, walled this in, moved it over here and opened this closet up from the bedroom. So again, if you recall from the original video, big closet door here, there was a small closet door here and a small closet there. So by closing that off and opening that up to the other side, this area here now becomes our coat closet. And then we were able to knock out the wall and extend this closet into where the original coat closet was and make a much bigger master closet. So this should be a real home run when we go to sell the house. And then they removed all that shelving and everything was over there to give us a nice bedroom space again. Of course, the bathrooms have been demoed. And uh, come out really good. No wood rot, no soft floors, nothing. Everything's solid. Still got to remove this thin glue on here. But again, this will make one continuous floor all the way into the bathrooms. Again, this is going to have a shower. And then it will be tiled all the way to the ceiling. Uh, and then commode. And unfortunately, just room for a 24-inch vanity here, but we'll put a, put a small vanity there. Same thing here in this bathroom. It's just a mirror image of that one. So again, 
uh, tile all the way to the ceiling. We will put a tub back in this one. Both bathrooms will have a niche, tall niche on the back wall. And so, um, so we'll do that. And then, uh, same thing, toilet, 24 inch come out, or vanity right there. And then this is the uh, closet, the uh, utility closet or um, whatever you call that uh, for towels and so forth, linen closet. So that'll stay. This is a second bedroom. So again, it demoed nicely. It already has a nice big closet as well. So that's nothing's changed in here. Just a little paint, drywall. And then finally, the smallest, ba smallest bedroom this one back here in the corner. And again, small little closet there too. And again, one continuous floor through the entire house. So this gives you a real sense for what the final footprint will look like. Again, I'm really, really happy with it. It's gonna make all the bedrooms and everything look much more like it was built originally. Maybe this is how it was built originally, uh, but we're definitely taking it back to a more usable, more open floor plan. So we'll do some more videos once things progress, to kind of keep you updated on how it's going. You remember there was an opening there. There used to be a door that had been put in there to that uh, closet that's right there. So I think that closet, this might've actually been the original coat closet now that I think about it. And this real small closet here was probably the original closet for that bedroom. Um, so somebody had closed that off a long time ago. Um, so anyway, we put that back too. So that's what we have. Uh, keep an eye out for the next video. Like I said, I'll keep you posted as things move forward. Uh, and once we uh, uh, start getting things, uh, things finished up.